Hi, I'm James from iChongqing and welcome to this transportation powerhouse series. Today I'm really excited because I'm going to show you the biggest dual purpose stay cabled bridge in the world, right here in Danuko District, Chongqing. Now when I say dual purpose, what I mean is that the top deck is going to have eight lanes of car traffic and the deck below is going to be used for the future number 18 subway line. And what's even better today is that the construction firm Second Harbour Engineering Company is going to give us exclusive access to the bridge above to both decks. The weather today in Chongqing is very typical for the winter. It's cold, wet, foggy, uh, it's not too windy. But nevertheless, no work continues on the bridge, no rain, hail or shine. The Steel Trust Cable Stayed Bridge has a main span of 660 metres. The tower reaches a height of 236 metres and is the tallest under construction in Chongqing. The steel truss beams are arranged in an inverted trapezoidal configuration with a 38 metre wide upper deck for an 8 lane two way urban expressway and a 19.2 metre wide lower deck for the river crossing of future rail transits line 18. The bridge cable tower adopts the spatial multi-curved shape of a water drop. The design inspiration comes from Chongqing, a city of mountains and rivers, and the confluence between the Yangtze and Jiaoling rivers. Okay, we're on our way up, and this is actually the first time I've been on a uh, construction site elevator like this. First of all, we've made it here onto the top deck of the bridge and my first feeling is this is absolutely huge. So yeah, easily you're going to get four big lanes of traffic in either direction. And the engineer who's coming with us has just told me that uh, each of these cables on this cable stayed bridge weighs 40 tons. So that's absolutely amazing. Ebanpai 我们这个桥塔设计就是设计成一个水滴形，就是为了来融入就我们周围这个环境，所以就是设计的时候提供更高的要求，然后设计出来这么复杂的一个桥，我们能去实现它，然后就对我们这个施工也提出了很高的一个
But despite the highly complex geographical terrain, Chongqing has successfully transformed itself into an international logistics hub. And amazingly, this is comprised of all the main transportation modes, such as aviation, rail, public roads, and the Yangtze River Golden Waterway. If you like what you've seen today, don't forget to like and subscribe to iChongqing. And don't forget to follow us as we're going to be bringing you more amazing projects, construction projects in Chongqing, which will show you how this city is driving the nation's status as a transportation powerhouse. Catch you later.